Look at your cat, cuddling, purring, maybe even napping on your favorite chair. Seems pretty domesticated, right? I've got a shocker. Every single house cat is a direct descendant of just five. Yes, yes. These cats came from one small area 10,000 years ago and took over the world on their own terms. But that's just the beginning. Let me show you how this self-domestication process really kicked off. Cats weren't domesticated by humans. They domesticated themselves for one huge reason, our food. The cats realized we created giant, moving mouse buffets, so they started living near us, not with us. The ones who learned to be friendly got the best scraps. Over time, that friendliness became bunting. But why did these wild cats even bother to hang around us in the first place? It certainly wasn't for our candy. Here's a shocking biological fact. Your cat cannot taste sweet things. They are literally immune to sugar. It's all thanks to a strange genetic mutation that shut down their sweet taste receptor gene, TAS1R2. This isn't about preference. It's true biological blindness to anything sugary. They just don't know it exists. But they don't care about our candy. What they do care about is what they can hear. And that sense is terrifyingly upgraded. Now here's where things get really interesting. This animal uses its specialized, independently moving ears to pinpoint a sound source with insane accuracy. Each ear can rotate separately, like tiny satellite dishes. They have 32 different muscles for this. Its precision lets them locate prey up to three feet away, accurate to a six inch radius. No hiding from this hunter. That's how they find the prey. But what happens next proves they're still terrifyingly wild. Fact 5. Even the laziest house cat shares nearly 95% of its DNA with a tiger. Your pampered pet has the same relentless predatory drive. That butt wiggle? It's pure, calculated, big cat energy. They are functionally identical hunters, just miniaturized. Their domesticated label is actually pretty fragile. And that relentless wild drive explains this strange, slightly gross habit they have when they bring home a prize. When your cat brings you a gift, it's not a peace offering. It's a literal hunting lesson. Cats bring live or dead prey to their kittens for practice. They think you are an incompetent hunter. If the gift is dead, they're teaching you how to dispatch it. If it's alive, you need to step up your game, friend. After all that hard work, hunting, judging us, the cat needs a break, and their secret weapon is already running. Hey, but how does this intense, wild behavior play out in their daily lives with us? Let's talk about the world's best sound. Fact 7. The cat's purr isn't just for happiness. It's a self-healing medical device. It generates low-frequency vibrations, between 25 and 150 hertz. This specific frequency range is scientifically proven to promote bone density and accelerate muscle healing. So, your cat is basically a furry, self-repairing robot with built-in vibration therapy. You can't make this stuff up. From self-healing to a move you won't see anywhere else in the animal kingdom. All right, you think a healing purr is wild? Hold on to your seat for this final scientific secret. First, the cats walk. They move their front and back leg on the same side together. It's called the diagonal walk. This is 100% unique in the mammal world, shared only by cats, camels, and giraffes. Why? Who knows? It's wild. They're physically perfect machines, but their ultimate secret is about communication and it changes everything. Fact 9. That iconic meow is not their language. It is a sophisticated sound developed only for humans. Adult cats rarely meow at each other. They communicate with complex scent, hisses, growls, and body language. 
The meow is a noise they learned after self-domestication to manipulate our bigger, slower brains. It's a specific, learned acoustic signal that triggers a response from us. It's custom-built communication. They figured us out. We respond to the meow like a baby crying, and they know exactly how to use it. They are not just our pets. They are incredibly sophisticated, self-made creatures that communicate on their own terms. So there you have it. The domestic cat might just be the most secretive, self-made creature on Earth. Next time your cat meows at you, remember, it's not a tiny tiger. It's a sophisticated, self-domesticated, self-healing wildcat. Developed a custom language just for you. How wild is that? Honestly, it's mind-blowing what we still don't know about them. Hit that like button and subscribe to National Geographic Kids for more mind-blowing science. And let me know in the comments, what is the weirdest gift your cat has ever brought you? Next time, we are tackling an animal that can regrow its entire brain.